I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw our five senses of our bodies. Five senses. Okay, I'm going to start over here. I'm going to put a dot and I'm going to draw a curved line up, down. Come back to the dot. I'm going to draw a curved line down, up, connect. Now I put another dot right next to that and I draw a curved line up, over, and down. Come back to the dot, draw a curved line down, up, connect. Go back to the first space and we're just going to mimic this top line. Just draw another curved line. Put another curved line inside and now up on the top we do one, two, three, four, five straight lines. I come over to the right hand side and inside I draw another curved line over mimicking the top one. And I put a curved line going down inside and then I draw one, two, three, four, five straight lines. These are my eyes and my eyes help me to see. Okay? I come straight down and I put a dot and from that dot I draw a curved line up, over, down, up, in, connect. Right about here I put another dot and I draw a curved line up, down and leave it floating. Come right inside, right here where the dot was, and I draw a curved line out, in, out, in, up, connect. This is my ear, and my ear helps me to hear. Okay? Come over here on the left hand side, put a dot, and I'm going to draw a curved line one, Curve line two, curve line three, curve line four, curve line five, curve line down, little curve line up, connect. This is my hand and it helps me to touch and feel things. Okay? Now I come straight down and I draw a little curve line. Come back to where I started, curve line down, up, connect. Right at the top I put another little curve line down. Now I draw, put a dot over here on the left and I'm going to draw a curve line up, in, out. Come back to the first dot, draw a curve line down, jump over, curve line up, connect. Come back to this first part, draw a little curve line down and a little curve line up. Come back to the first dot, draw a big curve line up and over. This is my tongue, this is my mouth, and this helps me taste things. Okay? Now I come all the way over here on the left and I'm going to draw a straight diagonal down, curve line over, curve line up, and leave it floating. This is my nose and I use it to smell. Now if I put all of these things together I get this little guy over here. So I put a dot and I put a curved line all the way around and connect. Come down to the bottom, put a straight line on the left, straight line on the right, little curved line, connect. Draw a straight line out and now we're going to go one, two, three, 
four, five curve lines connect. Come on the left hand side, draw a curve line out, curve line in on the right hand side, little straight lines all the way across. Come inside, put one dot, two dots, little curve line, straight, I mean, a uh, curve line over, up, little curve line, little straight line inside. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, to color this in, I made this a pink person, but first I'm going to do these green eyeballs. So I come up here and I color these in green. You can do yours any color you want. I use green because I wanted to pop a color. Then I come up and I do pink, and that is for my eyelid. And again, I chose pink because I wanted to pop a color. You can choose any color you want. I come down and this is my ear and I colored it pink. Okay? So this is your ear or my ear and I colored it pink. Then I get to my hand for touch and feel and I colored it brown. And I don't know why I did but I did. I probably should have continued using pink but I didn't. I colored it brown, so I'm going to stick with that. I think I might have done brown so you would know it was different, that it did something different other than just be who it, what it was. Then I come down to taste. This is my mouth. And I gave myself pink lips, top and bottom, because I wanted to do my tongue red. Sometimes I do things for a reason, sometimes I don't, but this time I did. And then I colored these little tiny sections on the right and on the left black so it looks like my mouth is open. And I'm sticking out my tongue. Then I came over and I did my nose pink. Okay? Just a little bit of pink. Now I come to my kid. The first thing I did was I drew a little bit of green on his eyeballs. And that is only because I want to remember that when you see, you use your eyes. That's what these are. Then, because he's got ears that are pink, and his nose is pink, I did his face pink. And I did his neck pink, which is down here, but I did his tongue red. And so it corresponds with this hand for touch and feel. I did this hand touch and feel, brown. Okay, you can color any which way you want. This is what I did. Let's see what it looks like all colored in. Okay, here are my five senses all colored in. We see with our eyeballs. We hear with our ears. We touch and feel with our hands. We taste with our tongues and mouth. We smell with our nose. And here are all five senses put together. Okay, bye-bye.